Ancestors The Humankind Odyssey is the ultimate game for every survival fans out there. Myself liking these types of games since Rust Legacy, getting thrown as an ape 10 million years ago where survival was the only option is an experience to behold, and Ancestors gives us exactly that. Now that I have your attention, let me tell you for 30 seconds about the Amazon forest fires that's been going on for weeks but no one knows about it. The governments of the world and primarily the president of Brazil are doing absolutely nothing to stop it. I'm telling you guys, this is the biggest, most tragic event that's happened in decades. Tons of species, plants and forests dying and nobody knows about it. I couldn't be playing a game with plenty of animals and beautiful forests and act like nothing's going on. The Amazon rainforest is the lungs of this planet. All I'm asking is if you have the time, please sign this petition to stop the burning of the Amazon. Link in the description. Now back to the video. Ancestors is a single player survival game that can take an infinite number of time for you to finish, as you'll always be evolving, whether it be through generations or thousands and thousands of years in the future. The developers wanted to put you at the center of the story. You 100% decide what the story slash future holds for yourself and your clan, just as our real ancestors did a million years ago. And no, don't worry, this is not a way for me or the developers to tell you it's a lazy game with no story at all. They really implemented something unique for this one. This is really your story, and there will be cutscenes at times when you discover and achieve some things which will give you other things with other cutscenes, on and on and on. It never stops, that's what's unique about it. You always evolve just like the world and animals around you. Now let me tell you Ancestors is a really hard game. If you don't like realistic hardcore games, then stay away from this as far as you can. I love games like this, but I was not prepared at all for my first playthrough. Ancestors threw me right into the game with my own clan and only asked me to survive forever, basically. What's bad and really good at the same time is the game never tells you what to do and how to do it. Even if you choose to have all the little tutorials, it never goes to the point of telling you exactly. For example, if you're poisoned, it only says you need to fight something with medicinal purposes. So remember that little mushroom you picked up a while ago? Yeah, this one might work. My first playthrough was a huge defeat. I wasn't informed I could build myself a new house, craft weapons, steal honey and make babies. I discovered lots of things with my clan, but ultimately fell out of a tree. My other clan members killed by giant snakes, giant tigers, and so on. My second playthrough though was a success. Like they tell you at the beginning, this is your evolution. So take your time and become familiarized with everything, which is exactly what I did. Then I upgraded a lot of my abilities, made new friends for my clan, made tons of babies, and then decided to pass a generation. That's when I was ready to explore. I left the jungle I knew and made a new home in a beautiful place. 
after a while I was ready to evolve through the ages. What I woke up to was a really different world with different creatures all around that are just even uglier than before. What I love about Ancestors is the world never stops changing. You will see many different creatures and places going through the ages. You can build yourself a home anywhere you'd like, put protection around it and a bed, of course. This is just my opinion, but Ancestors is one of the best survival game I've played and is definitely a must if you like this genre.